Hello everybody and welcome to SnackTube. A storm has been ripping its way across Scotland and then a second storm has also been ripping its way across Scotland. So it's been cold, wet and windy for the last week or so. So I figured I would snuggle up in my snood and have myself a wee treat. A wee French treat. This is a Brossard Savan Chocolat. Uh, so, this little thing I got from a Snackverse box. You may have heard of Snackverse. They are a subscription service that send out food from a different country each month and they have different tiers of boxes. So I get the premium box as it stands. This is something that I had uh, subscribed to for a while before. Uh, just the medium box. What do they call it now? Um, the original box. Uh, but I stopped for a while because I actually ended up getting another, the same country again. So I feel like I'd done everything I had. But I figured I'd go back to it um, and see if anything's changed. And so far it's been quite good. I've had two boxes. Uh, the last one, I can't remember what the country was. I'll put the link to the video for it though in the card so you can go and check it out. But there were some really nice things in that box. And so far I've had a few things out of the French box and they've been nice too. So I figured I would give this a try for you guys. Um, I'm not going to you know, every month just try hundreds of different things from the box. I'll pick like one thing from the box and show it to you guys. In this case, this is from the premium box. So you have to pay the big money to get it. So, uh, yeah, I figure probably that's a good idea in future is to do something from the premium box because not everyone's going to pay for the premium box. Uh, but I'm willing to do that for you guys and because I like food. So this is a Brossard Savan Chocolat. Now, according to the description in this uh, leaflet that comes with it. It's a pack of two soft sponge marble cakes with a delectable chocolate flavour. Their convenient size and delicious taste make them a favoured snack option. These pocket cakes offer a convenient and satisfying treat. So, sounds nice. Um, so far, I'm trying to think what's the best thing I've had out of this box so far. A lot of this has been really nice. They have the, the Nestle nuts. That was really nice. I really enjoyed that. Um, there was um, a Tropical Oasis, which I drank. That was really, really good. Um, and all the crisps. They had loads of different flavours of crisps. I've still got the bacon fritels. I haven't tried them yet. Um, but yeah, so far, everything in the box has been quite good. So I can't complain. But let's uh, have a look at this. Um, all the stuff on here is probably going to be in French. So I don't know how much I can really learn from the packaging. But uh, we'll see what we can do. It says, the description is... Gâteau Marbré au Chocolat. Um, okay. And there's a list of ingredients there. Um, if you're French or speak French, you can try and read that if you want. Um, oh, hold on. <laughs> there's, there's English. GB, there is English on it. All right. Cool. Right. So it's chocolate marble cakes. And there's the list of ingredients in English if you want to actually read them. Uh, cool. Possible presence of peanuts, nuts and milk. Uh, there's also eggs, soya, and wheat in it. So if you've got any of those as allergens, best to avoid. Uh, so the net weight, it's 60 grams, the whole packet. So each cake is around 30 grams. Let's see if we can find any nutritional information. Under the flap, maybe. Um, ah, here we, here we go. Um, all right, cool. This pack contains two portions. Have we got pair? Oh, we've got pair of hundred grams, which is annoying. So I'm not going to do the maths because I cannot be bothered. But let's um, let's go through pair of hundred grams. So pair of hundred grams, you've got four hundred and forty-one calories. Sounds about right. So you're talking, yeah, just over hundred calories per cake, which you know, makes sense. Fat, twenty-four grams. Um, of which 3.4 is saturated, so not a lot of saturated fat per cake. Um, again, roughly 6 grams per cake, maybe of fat, something like that. Uh, carbs, 48 grams, so yeah, about 15 grams maybe, of uh, carbs, of which 24 is sugar, so 6 or 7 of that would be sugar. Uh, dietary, I'm maybe not dividing these things right. Don't count on my maths, people. I'm, I'm, I do not claim to be a mathematician. Um, I'm a software developer. I don't, I don't, I should be good at maths. 
as a software developer. I, I'm probably better than most people, but um, quick maths in my head. Nah, I'm terrible at it. That's what calculators are for. This is why God invented calculators. Go God. Uh, protein, 5.3 grams. Uh, so yeah, about two per cake, something like that. Salt, 0 0.5 grams. So not a lot of salt in each one. Cool. All right. Let's open up these things and have a wee look see then, shall we? It says they're individually packaged. So there you go there. They come in a wee silver bag. Um, so we can open up one of these. What's the date on it? 1509.24. So decent shelf life. Uh, I got this in, what, beginning of January? Or it might have been end of December. Uh, so, yeah, decent enough shelf life. Okay. Looks like a cake. I find that a lot of the stuff in the France box says a cake. It's like cakes in packets and stuff. They do a lot of cakey things in France, it would seem. Very uh, popular over there, I suppose. Uh, cool. You can smell the chocolate. Looks okay. Looks a bit plain. But you can see, actually, you can see the marbling. See the different colours there. That's not really been done very well, but um, hopefully when we bite into it, it's actually got that, that pattern. All right, so these are Savan Chocolat from Brossard. Let's uh, give it the old taste test, or le old taste test. I, I, I didn't fail French, but I didn't do well either. Okay. I was better at German. Fun fact, the German teacher in my old primary school was the wife of former Rangers goalkeeper, Stefan Kloss. I never had her as my German teacher, though my brothers did, but I didn't. Um, but I always thought that was quite cool because he lived in Helensburg at the time. I don't know what he does now because he's well since retired, but... Hmm. Well, it's moist. I find a lot of the time with these packeted duck cakes, they tend to be quite dry, but it's moist enough. But it's not really got any flavour. I mean, it's supposed to be chocolate flavour, right? But even the brown bit of the cake doesn't taste chocolatey. No. Yeah. It just tastes like plain cake. There's no icing or anything on it. Um, yeah, strange. It's meant to be chocolate flavour, but there's, there's no chocolatey flavour to it at all. It's just, it just tastes like cake. It doesn't really taste like chocolate whatsoever. Let's keep the other one and see. Maybe I just got a bad one, I don't know. I doubt it. Well, let, me, let me just bite into this one. Again, it's like just the marbling at the, at the end point. That's weird. Yeah. Hmm. That one's the same. It's a bit boring, to be honest. Just tastes like plain cake. I'm not getting any chocolate. Not getting any particular other flavours like vanilla or anything. Just kind of tastes like plain old cake. Without any flavour. It's, uh, it's a bit sweet, but apart from that. Boring. Really, really boring. Wow. Hmm. Well, that's, that's actually probably the the most disappointing thing I've got in, in the box so far. <laughs> Which is funny. Because I had one that was um, Madeline's. Which were a bit dry, but it still tasted okay. And um, they weren't, uh, they were actually very similar to this in flavour, but they were never claiming to be anything but, you know, just plain cake. That's meant to be chocolate. A slight hint of chocolate when I smelled it, but as far as flavour goes, there is no flavour of chocolate in that whatsoever. So I think that's quite misleading. 
to be honest. Yeah, poor. Poor effort, France. Be better. Shocking. How terrible are you, France? Can't make good cake, can't even win the World Cup. Shocking. <laughs> so, thanks very much for watching, guys. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Um, hit the wee bell to get notifications anytime uh, my videos come out. I upload twice a week, so you want to come back and watch all them. Also, head on the channel, check out some other videos. I've got loads in there. There'll be a few in the cards here. Sort of recommended videos you should probably check out. And uh, yeah, leave me a comment. Let me know what uh, what you like, what you want me to try. Are you French? What do French people think of these things? I'd like to know the French opinion. And um, I'd also like to apologise to the fr any French people watching for my terrible jokes. It's all it's all in jest, I, I assure you. But uh, yeah, pretty disappointing cake, in my opinion. So let me know in the comments if you've tried it and what you think. Uh, but for now, that will do me, and I will catch you in the next video. See you then.